we're back again. Another storage unit bought. Bought this one online. 10 by 10, pretty full. It's $110. Um, not the greatest looking unit, but it's literally right behind my building, right behind my store. Um, there's two storage facilities, and this is one of the facilities that's literally right in our backyard. So for 110 bucks, but I did spot some stuff when I was looking close, some um, like decent stuff kind of hidden in there. So hopefully it turns out all right. But kind of a little hole in the wall place here, as you can see. And actually, if we come right over here, let's see. Okay, you can't from here, but if I go right over there on that hill, right over there near those containers, and I look that way, right on the, those tall pine trees right there, that's our store's right on the other side of there. Like, facing the other way, there's another road that way. I got Keith here to help me today, but he's too busy on his phone. Get off your yeah, phone. Come on, we, we got work to do. Keith's ever okay, he's scheduling meetings. He's got his Iron Maiden shirt on, his camo hat. He's ready to load. But that's the required uniform. So as you can see, kind of a mess looking, but there's a lot of stuff in here. But I could see that this chair was here, and the chair looked nice. I mean, it looked like, you know, kind of newer style furniture. And then I could kind of see in here. I could see this in there. That looks like a nice piece of furniture and just kind of a clue. They might have some stuff. Or piece of a bed right here. This kind of farmhouse looking. It's not real wood, I don't think, or old, but it's just that kind of farmhouse style. So I just kind of figured we got something right here. Somebody that might have, you know decent taste on some furniture but I don't really know if there's truly gonna be much in here good kids shoes I don't know what that says clothes there's a Nike box Candace clothes somebody was named Candace a pink camping chair and I saw this white dresser but it's pretty here in person it's got a it's dirty anyways. It's got somewhere, but we'll get this thing um guinea pig food. Guinea pig food or oh yeah, guinea pig food. Yeah. Maybe there's guinea pig Lots of dirt down there, but as you can see, I mean right outside the door it's just dirt. This is it's not paved. Not even dirt. They actually got just grass growing everywhere right here. I hope we find a guinea pig. So I think there's the a table top, so I'm hope maybe there's legs and a whole set. I see another leg. Way back there sticking up. Looks like it might be another chair leg. But this chair anyway looks pretty nice. If there's a whole dining set, that'll be good. This thing's got some nicks and dings in it. But like I said, it was close by, and for the amount of stuff, I don't usually buy. Usually, I've seen a lot of units pop up at this facility online, and they're usually just horrible. I mean, this thing's kind of rough, but the ones that most of the ones that I see, I mean, I look at them from, and I'm just, I, even though they're right behind me, I just can't even do it. And for some reason, I've seen a lot of them here go for a lot of money. I don't know why, but two, three hundred dollars for a little. Five by five with some boxes in it. There was actually one here. It went for t it was over two hundred dollars, and it was a ten by ten like this, and it just had boxes down the side, around the back, and I looked close trying to find something that they were seeing, but it was just regular old boxes. I mean, a lot of a lot of them said that there were pictures, that kind of thing. So maybe it was the actual owners bidding on their stuff. It's the only thing I could figure out. Alright, so we got clothes. We got a teddy bear. It's Teddy the Bear. Some clothes and junk down in there. Kids shoes and Candace storage. That's what it looks like. It's just... 
Uh, let's see. A little bit rough. Some vans. Yeah, some Converse. Some decent little shoes, but these, I think a dog chewed on this. An Under Armour tennis shoe, it's all. Oh, the guinea pig, yeah. I keep forgetting about the guinea pig. This looks like books, a Bible. No, this is the toolbox, but I think it's a girl's unit, so the, the toolbox is not going to be, it's going to be like this. I guarantee it's just a little box with a few screwdrivers and stuff in it. Yeah, there's their tool. There is a Bosch battery. No. And we got the typical little farmhouse style wall decor here. All right, I think these people are professional colorers. I keep finding coloring books. This box has a bunch of coloring books in it. Advanced coloring graffiti. Hey Keith, she was a professional colorer, a professional adult. Whoa, spider just came right down. <laughs> they got guard spiders oh, okay. too. They just came right off of the door here and dropped right down onto my shoulder. Hey man, I've had a rat jump out of the box and hit my leg before. Come on. That still could happen here. We're just getting started. All right, finding lots of clothes so far. But look at that right there, Columbia. Nice Columbia vest. So I think the, there is going to be some nice clothes mixed in here. Oh, here's the um, Bosch drill key. Oh, and it works. Though there's a battery in the that box. I wonder if the charger was in the little Bosch. Mm -hmm. This lampshade is. Destroyed. So we got a coffee table buried in here. Bears, bears. I don't know. It looks like it says bears, bears back. Not really sure there. Build a bear there and a horse, Wells Fargo horse. There's some other stuff in here. Let's see. Pictures. Oh, we got Michelangelo here. Yeah, the orange is Michelangelo. His weapon is the nunchucks. Everybody knows that. You didn't know that, Keith? We got a TENS unit. TENS unit. Blue. Alright, yeah. Clothes isn't really all that exciting, but this, this thing's definitely going to have lots of good clothes. Hollister jeans. It was a young, it looks like a younger girl stuff, and then with kids. So it's kind of a lot of... I guess you could say more in style brands. What is this? LG Superior Auto retractable earbuds. 
and that's not what's in here. For lots of clothes, and then anytime I do see something besides clothes, it's just like an empty box. Alright, we do have a box from the bathroom. And, okay, we got a jewelry holding thing here. Do you have any silver jewelry, maybe? Don't know. See anything right off hand that's that I knew was silver? That I'm oh, it's upside down. What all these pieces are right here? There's a quarter and a and a nickel. amazing sometimes how people really just don't have much of anything besides clothes. There's a little quasi modem hunchback. I haven't even looked to see if there's stuff inside the drawers yet. I think it needs a little tightening. <laughs> Good lord. There's nothing in the drawers. Alright, we just moved this nightstand and underneath it is that all the um guinea pig food? What? All that. Yeah. It like I guess a rat or something pulled it all under there and made a nest. <laughs> Golly. It looks like it really came out of that bag. Yeah. I don't know. This is one of the rare boxes in here that's not closed, or at least it says it's not closed. Album and decor. That doesn't mean it's anything good, but something different. And by album, Keith, it means baseball card album. No. Not really. <laughs> I don't really think there's much in the way of decor. Some candles. Yeah, there's like photo albums around there. And then there's the book, Corduroy. Corduroy the Bear. Oh, you know what? I saw Cordu Corduroy the Bear was in a bag. The bear from that book. Then. He's, wearing, well, he's wearing green corduroy overalls. And I saw him. There's not really any decor at all in here. It's just it's pictures. Alright, the only hope for finding anything besides hangers and clothes. Oh, we did find a box of paperwork. <laughs> but maybe, maybe back here, that says books, that says storage. Maybe this corner here will find a little something different. The ottoman is just a little bit smashed. <laughs> just a tiny bit. I was hoping this would be something besides clothes, but I don't know because that says winter wear. That's soft, like it could be closed. Books, let's see what. Binders, baby books. Just 
They're like little baby scrapbooks and stuff like that. Right, this one does say Nick Knacks. We will see. And it's not really Nick <laughs> Golly. There is a little metal basket. There's a measuring cup, a pot. I mean, baskets is not nice. a picture holder and a glass jar. So not really most of what I would consider knickknacks, but Dr. Seuss. Where the sidewalk ends. That's it. Viable. Okay. It's a big speaker in a dog cage. Baby blankets. Some markers. So that's pretty much it. I mean, it's the boxes were, I mean, literally. It was either clothes, shoes, coat hangers, or other than that, it was just kind of like paperwork, books, that kind of thing, coloring books. Really hardly anything else besides that. As far as any actual household stuff or anything, very little. There's a coffee maker laying there and a pile of crap in a lamp. It was kind of a little bit odd because there was just so little in the way of anything besides the, the furniture and then just clothing and stuff like that. All right, we got the unit back to the um, store here, and we got a couple little problems. Sorry, there was only three legs for this table. So it's a really nice table. It's got the four chairs, and look at it right here. Here's the table, and it has the bench. So if I can get all this thing together, that's at least 200 bucks, but it only has three legs. But Keith's telling me he's going to make a leg for it. There he is. Keith, you're going to make a leg, right? I'm going to make a leg. Be I told him he didn't have to. We were just going to sell the chairs, but he wants to make a leg. So we will see how that goes. And if we walk out here, I'll show you a couple of other things that came out of that unit. The unit overall, it was kind of disappointing. I mean, it's just a lot of clothes. We can sell clothes. Um, just not a lot of good stuff to show on the video here when I'm just looking at bags and containers of clothes. But we can fill the dollar area up with that. We put them all out there, sell them for a dollar. It does add up. But, like, you know, only paid 110 so money-wise, not bad. I've got this pair of nightstands here. I got $80 on the pair here. 75 on this tall, skinny chest. Um, if we come over here, this rug was out of there. 25 bucks. This sofa table. Somebody's already pulled the tag off for some reason. $75. That table there, $35. I don't know why they pulled the, ta the tag off of there fix that and then if we come around here let's see this little bed set right here nice little full bed with the nightstand I got 150 bucks on that so those items there are all out of that unit and then we got all the little stuff and the table set if Keith can get it fixed like I said that's at least 200 bucks if you can't get it fixed, I can still sell those chairs for 30, 40 bucks each and then the bench for 40 bucks or so. So, I mean, sometimes you almost come out just as good just selling the chairs, but it'd be nice to get the legs on that table and sell the whole thing to somebody, a whole set. All right, that's pretty much it for that unit. Overall, 110 bucks, you know, a few nice pieces of furniture, even though the one table is missing a leg, but Keith is working on a leg for us on that one. Um, the boxes were kind of disappointing. Lots of clothes and shoes. The uh, good thing is it is sellable stuff, but just kind of disappointing on, you know, stuff to show you to go through. And I was really looking for some stuff to go in my ox, you know, some household items, you know, decor, anything like that. But just mostly books. I'm sorry, not books. Oh, there was some books. Clothing and shoes. And, you know, the furniture. So overall, money-wise, not a bad deal. It was close by, not a bad deal. But... Um, just not a whole lot of great stuff to show you unfortunately in that one 
that's it for this one. If you like the video, hit the like button. Got more coming up here. I'm going to get another unit tomorrow. Um, hit the subscribe button, and you all have a good one.